Hey y'all. I've had a motherfucking rough day. Very fucking rough. Yep. <laughs> yep. Should I do this? Should I do this? Nah. Okay, I'm here to talk. Cause you know, um, I'm not gonna tell you what I've been through today. But it just, you know, made me talk about what I'm going to talk about. Okay. So anybody that's in school right now, I don't know if you're popular or you're the one that gets bullied. If you're popular, let's just start by there. If you're popular and you see somebody get bullied in school and you don't do shit about it or you laugh about it, you think it's a joke to just be like, oh, <laughs> they're getting beat up, blah, blah. It's really not it. And guess what? It's gonna be your turn, but with fucking karma. With a slap that you're not even gonna see it come. Now, for the people that do get bullied, I've been there, you know? I've been in that situation. Hold on, let me plug my phone, because they don't plug. Fuck. <laughs> let me see if this doesn't like fall. Let me just put it closer. There. Oh shit, my head. Okay. I'm back. You've been bullied? Yeah. But you know why? Thank it. And that's why for the ones who get bullied right now, I just want you to know that you're going to be okay. Even though right now you're not. <laughs> Even though right now might seem like the world's falling on you, like you have no escape. You're literally a piece of shit. That's how I felt. You're not. You're not. You're going to get better. In the future, just wait two years, two, three years. You get out of school and you're going to have to laugh. Because you're going to be stronger than those people. It's hard for me to talk all this shit in, in English, my bad. <laughs> it's going to be hard for those people that were laughing at you, not going through it at all. Just be like, oh, I'm in my own world, making sure. <gasps> no way. That should feel. Making sure that um, that you're just having a miserable life. So, my bad. So many things just happen right now. I don't even know what I'm saying. That should just feel. Okay. Um, I just want to be honest. Yeah. It's hard being bullied because i've been there i've had almost put my head on the toilet don't feel sorry for me i don't feel sorry for me for that <laughs> i don't feel sorry for the times that people try jumping me i don't feel sorry for the times people have told me all these names that i wasn't gonna be nothing that I was a piece of shit i don't feel sorry for myself i don't i'm actually thankful because those people has made me stronger and I want you to know that when you get bullied, you the shit. Everybody in the school might think that you're not, but you are. And you're going to win at the end. Because whoever's laughing now, it's not going to laugh later. Just know that shit. This makes me cry every day. I know, I know a lot of my fans are going through bullying and it makes me sad. Because, you know, if I ever, you know, catch school time on the car... And I ever see somebody getting bullied, just know I'm going to beat the fuck out of you. <laughs> I'm 17. Once I turn 18, I can beat the fuck out of you. But just know I will. I will if I see you bullying somebody. Because it's just not right. But at the same time, those people that get bullied now or got bullied, the ones that got bullied could tell me now. Tell me you ain't fucking strong right now. Tell me the shit that you go through today is worse and the shit you used to go through back then. But guess what? You're handling that shit like a boss. You're handling all the fucking stress like a boss. And I'm not even going to tell you what the fuck happened to me today. For me to be all this. To me give you all this speech. <laughs> but just know I went through it. Just like anybody. Preach sessions with Malu. Really? Speak Spanish. Yo puedo hablar español. Y les puedo decir a la gente... Que habla español. 
Um, yo no hablo mucho español, no porque no quiera, sino porque me costó mucho aprender inglés. Y cuando yo iba a la escuela, que yo hablaba español, era como algo que no se, ve, no, no se veía bien para ellos. O sea, yo hablaba español y era algo malo. Yo tenía que leer en inglés, no sabiendo inglés, tenía que leer en inglés. Y la profesora, la profesora, no estoy ni hablando de los estudiantes ni nada de eso, la profesora se reía en mi puta cara. <ríe> o sea, era algo que se reía en mi puta cara. Como que yo soy estúpida por no saber inglés o por querer aprenderlo. O por mudarme al país para tener una vida mejor. Que ni la hay. <ríe> ni la fucking hay. <ríe> O sea, la gente se muda aquí y la gente es más tóxica que la mierda que cagan todos los días. Literalmente. Literalmente. La gente es más tóxica que la mierda que cagan aquí todos los días. Porque a ti te hagan bullying en la escuela no significa que eres una mierda. Si no sabes inglés, vas a aprender inglés y te aseguro que vas a aprender más de un idioma. Yo quiero aprender más de un idioma. Pero te aseguro que vas a ser mejor que todos los gilipollas y subnormales que te hicieron bullying en la escuela y se rieron en tu puta cara. Así de sencillo. A mí me dijeron, tú no vas a hacer nada en la vida. Tú no vas a ser cantante, tú no vas a tener nada especial en tu vida porque siempre te quedas dormida. Bueno, me quedaba dormida porque no podía dormir por cosas que no quiero decir. Y... No me gustaba la escuela porque cada vez que iba a la escuela me metían un trompazo por la cara o venían siete niñas y me metían cuatro trompazos, no uno, cuatro. <ríe> ¿Me entiendes? ¿O no me entiendes? Amén, así eres, a así eran mis maestras. ¿Pero qué? Que les chupe un huevo a las maestras. Dile, chupa mi huevo, maestra, because yo si voy a hacer algo... Marfa... The teachers that be saying, oh, you never gonna be shit, tú nunca vas a hacer nada, bla, bla. Bitch, look at you. Why are you talking shit while you there? You know what I'm saying? ¿Por qué mierda tú estás hablando mientras tú estás haciendo ese trabajo? Like, tú eres profesora porque tienes que ayudar a los estudiantes a querer aprender, a querer estar en la escuela. No reírte en su puta cara, no decir que nunca van a hacer nada. Hay profesores que son la maldita fucking mierda. Yo he tenido uno de este flaco, así de alto, pero más alto que la puta puerta de esa ahí. Y es bien alta, mira, es a tomar por culo. He tenido un profesor así de alto y así de flaco, queriéndome dar a mí con una puta regla. Una regla, una puta regla. Yo estaba durmiendo y casi me dio con una puta regla. Le, tú estás aquí para darme... ¿Para decirme cosas o para querer que yo aprenda? Porque con palos un niño no aprende. Con bullying un niño no quiere ir a la escuela. So, hay algunos... Hay, no, hay algunos no. Muchos de los padres piensan que cuando su hijo no quiere ir a la escuela significa que no le gusta estudiar o no le gusta aprender o no quiere ser nada en la vida. No. A lo mejor es porque en la puta escuela le tratan como puta mierda y no quiere aprender nada. Eso se cierra en un puto hueco y no quiere hacer nada. Porque literalmente cuando te hacen bullying, you feel like you're like deep on a hole. And there's no way out. So you ain't gonna tell me to anybody out here. If your mom tells you this, you better tell her. Do you know what I go through? No, right? If your dad tells you, do you know what I go through? No, right? Exactly. Like that. Anybody want to ask me questions? Because I'm out here to preach today, bitch. I'm out here to preach the fuck today. Fighting, it's no good. You're not the shit because you beat the fuck out of somebody. Oh, wow. You could beat the fuck out of somebody. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. You're not scared. Guess what, bitch? In life, that's not all about that. In life, you better have manners. You better have fucking mind. Not everything you solve it. With fucking fighting. And that's about it. So, que alguien me pregunte algo. 
Anybody fucking tell me something that you want me to talk about, because I will. How do you stop the bullying? You don't. Unless you have the balls that I did it. <laughs> Unless you have the balls for those who bully you, which is not always the answer, but sometimes it is the answer when they're fucking going at it, you know? When it's somebody like there, there every day, like, they don't just stone stop, then yeah, just fucking punch them back, like, be like, boom, boom, and swing. Swing, just swing. Just do the same thing that just you. Like that. Literally. Body, but body shaming, it's a big thing these days. You know what? That's fucking true. I get that shit all the time. Yeah, be like, oh, you're so pretty. Oh, you so this. I love your body. Me dicen a mí que yo soy linda. Lo voy a decir en las dos. Me dicen a mí que yo soy linda. Que yo tengo un, un cuerpo hermoso. Una cara hermosa. Pero el bullying que hacen estos días, the bullying that they do these days, for those who have, I don't know, skinny, is that is anything, you could be skinny, overweight, anything, you have no boobs, boobs, they're still gonna bully you over that, like literally, <laughs> over anything. Tú puedes ser flaca, te van a decir que te parece un palo, cuando comes y te pones... Tú sabes, te pones rellenita, para no decir gorda, te pones rellenita. Te dicen, baja de peso, ve al gimnasio. People don't, don't get satisfied. That's why you have to be happy with yourself. Tú no puedes escuchar a la gente todo el rato. Oh, porque si el, perro, porque si el pelo lo tienes, damage. Oh, porque si eres muy flaca. Oh, porque si eres muy rellena. ¿Qué pinga me importa? Si a mí me gusta comer, yo voy a comer hasta que me muera. Tú no eres yo. Si yo quiero ser flaca, o no es que quiera, es que soy flaca. Voy a vivir con eso. Tengo que aprender a querer lo que tengo. No lo que alguien tiene. Just like that. You gotta learn how to love what you have. What you have to live with. You gotta learn how to love that. You can't just love Something else of somebody that probably that person doesn't even like or love themselves. How about that? Let me see. La gente se ve bella como sea. Exacto. <laughs> Mija, tú sabes cuánta gente se va a tener que colocar extensiones. Yo me coloco extensiones. Yo tengo peluca por todos lados. Yo antes era gabba. Ahora es que me está creciendo el pelo. Pero yo hace unos meses era gabba. Tenía pelo, mira, por aquí. Y no porque se me estaba cayendo el pelo ni nada. Es porque yo, la mus subnormal, esta de aquí, la retrasada mental, se cortó el pelo por aquí. Se rapó todo esto como Rihanna. Y se rapó todo esto de aquí atrás como Rihanna. So, mira... Peluca para abajo, peluca para arriba si quieres y si te da la gana. Si eres capa, ponte crema en tu capa y di que eres feliz capa. ¿Tú sabes cuánta gente se le va a caer el pelo de ser tan odiosa? ¿Tú sabes que... I'm talking so cute right now. ¿Tú sabes que cuando tú das maldición a alguien o tú dices algo a alguien, te va a venir para atrás? O sea, te va a venir como un tren. Tú coges el tren aquí en Madrid y va a volver a Madrid. Si tú hablas mierda de esa persona por lo que tenga, por si es capa, por si no es capa, porque si es flaca, porque si es gorda, te va a llegar todo lo que tú has hablado a ti. No a Juan Pablo, ni a Tostito, ni a nadie. Te va a llegar a ti, a ti misma. So, si sigue hablando mierda de la gente que la capa vas a, va, vas a ser tú. So, ni te preocupes de la que te estén diciendo que, uff, tú tienes extensiones. Ay, Dios mío, no tienes pelo natural. Hating ass bitches that probably have extensions and you don't even know about it. <laughs> Period. ¿Qué más? Déjame poner esto. <laughs> I'm not gonna answer that one. Hold on. I don't know where it starts with this year. 
Okay, let me see. But my friends bully me, but I have to forgive them or I get beat up. Bitch, where you stay at? <laughs> Bitch, where you stay at? Because I don't like fighting and more in the street or in a community because you could get arrested even for a day. A day, and you get arrested with the bitch that you fought. That's why I never done it. Cause <laughs> no, I'll go crazy. But let me know where the fuck you stay at, because I'll get my fans, I'll get my family, I get everybody, and beat the fuck out of your friends. First of all, don't call them friends. Don't call them friends. That's first. Don't call them friends. Cause your friends, first of all, in this world, if I'm being fucking honest, you don't have friends. If you think you have a best friend, you fucking don't. If you think you have a sis or a little slippity slubby, you don't, bitch. You fucking don't. You fucking don't. Once is the time that they're getting something and they have to run you over for it, they're gonna do it. <laughs> they're gonna do it. If they have to run you over to get what they want, they will. They will. They will wake up. You ain't got no fucking friends in this bitch. You got known people that you know. Yeah, you could call them friends. You know what I'm saying? You could call them friends. But that doesn't mean they're your friends. Another thing. Keep your enemies closer than your friends. Just an advice. Just an advice. Because the bitch is 17 and it's kind of learning shit even if I'm a little bit slow. Just know. Let me see. Any more questions, bitch? Because I'm ready today. I'm ready. Let me see. Somebody wrote. <laughs> Eres la puta majo del tío. Yo no. Todas ustedes. Te tienes que mirar en el espejo como el money heist. Te tienes que mirar en el espejo y decir, yo soy la puta ama, tío. Y si te gusta bien y si no, también. Yo soy la puta ama y si te jode, que te joda bien, 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 pero bien pa' dentro. Pa' dentro, 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 dentro. Que te joda, pero psh, dentro. Like that. Tú te dices a ti misma, tú eres la puta ama. Tú le dices a tu amiga, ah, yo tengo el pelo bello y yo soy la puta ama. Y tu amiga te dice que no, que te dejes de hacer la, la, la maripil y que te dejes de hacer la, ¿cómo se llama eso? I don't know how to say it in Spanish now. There's some words that I forget. Um, que te deje de hacer like, like you're the best? No, bitch, you are the best. Fuck you mean. Shit. You got me fucked up. A uh, fuck? What am I supposed to tell myself? You ugly as fuck. You never gonna be shit. My hair is ugly. That shit never gonna grow. I should just cut it again. Um, I'm so fucking skinny. I'm always gonna be skinny. Why are you gonna bring yourself down? That's what bitches want you to do. And that's our, those are not your friends. Be fucking cocky, bitch. You are the shit. Fuck you, me. You wake up in the morning, smell your fucking grajo, and if they have peste, you be like, psh, psh. La huepa le si, y ya, my guy. You walk around like you the shit. Fuck you, me. And if you smell like shit, you walk around like you the real shit. Fuck you, me. Fuck. You're talking about, oh, don't be calling yourself too pretty. Don't be calling yourself like you're the shit because you're not the shit. You're just being cocky right now. You're just being cocky. What am I supposed to be like? I'm not the shit. I'm a shit. No, bitch. You're not. Fuck me. Fuck me. <laughs> it's like if I let bitches tell me that my hair is dead. You know what? You know why I cut in my hair? My dumbass was listening to people. Wow. What's something that I haven't done? <laughs> Let me tell you something. I cut in my hair because people were telling me that it was dead. Me decían, tu pelo está horrible. Oh my God, tu pelo está, que las puntas están así, mira. Tiene que estar así las puntas y las puntas están así. Que fui la normal yo. I was the dumbass bitch that went and did this because I was listening to people. If you always listen to people, you're never going to get nowhere, bitch. You just know that shit. Just fucking know that shit. That one of the motherfuckers. Be like, that one of pussy. That one of pussy. That one of pussy. All right, next. <laughs> Mira. Come to the 
Lily go. Come to Lily go, me go. Um, I'm dropping a song. Say I'm a la calle. Vamos pa la calle. Mm, mm. But I just can't sing anymore. You know, I can't sing much of the song. By the way, I went through it today. So let me put some. Let me put some. Let me tell you something, my guy. Aquí, todo tiene solución. Todo. Everything has solution. Si tú te tienes un peo, hay perfume. Si tú hueles mal, hay conditioner. Hay um, dry spray. I like the dry spray because it keeps you dry. But, you know, anything has solution except that la paz me. You know what I'm saying? You die, you ain't, you ain't got no solution. You ain't got no music, you see, eyes, ah. No, no, that shit. You ain't going back to life, bitch. <laughs> Just know. But all the rest has fucking solution, bitch. Everything has solution. You just gotta look for it. You gotta be Dora, the Explorer Dora, and look for it. You know what I'm saying? This is gonna be my mic. This is gonna be my mic today. Jesus. Jesus, Padre Nuestro, que está en el cielo. Dame um, esperanza y dame paciencia. <laughs> que no tenga ninguna de las dos. <laughs> but let's leave it there. <laughs> Your hair is damaged as fuck. Guess what, bitch? Look at it. It's not. Uh, hate on it. Uh, you probably have straight hair. Uh. <laughs> All right, let me stop. Straight hair is still pretty, but you just gotta be a hating asshole. All right. What? Oh, hell no. Where's Danny? He went to get something. Um, let me see. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. What's your diet? <laughs> I don't have a diet. Matter of fact, I eat a lot. And I don't gain weight. <laughs> Only when my body wants to. Ain't that crazy? It's crazy. It's called fast metabolism, my guy. <laughs> and that's what I have. <laughs> it's curly hair, hard to maintain. I'm gonna answer that question right the fuck now. We got this product. Right? We got this product. Let me put this a little bit more up. That's if he wants to. Okay, I gotta turn it around. Alright. I'm gonna show you all the fucking products just to see how many products I gotta put in my hair. We got this product, which this is not a product. This is C, um, ocean water. All right, we got the first one. We got this shit that is oil, so it won't be dry as a motherfucker. Then we got. Then we got this shit. This is my friend. Because this motherfucker, I put it at night. Yeah. For all my curly bitches hair, this is the shit. You put this at night from here down. Not in your, you know. You put this from here down. And that shit will whoop your hair. I'm not going to keep going because if not, I'm going to take forever. And I don't want to talk about curly hair. I want to talk about something important. So let's get back to business, bitch. All right. I'm back with my mic. Let's see. Any other questions, motherfucker? Let me see. Let me see. Um. Pero si le pone la canción, le una depresión total. What's your favorite color? Look at my nails. I gotta do them tomorrow. You so hype? When I go through it, there's a when I go through shit in the day, in the meantime, then I just be happy. Like, I don't know why, but I go through it and I'm like this. <laughs> I could be crying, but I'm like this. What's next, bitch? What's fucking next? <laughs> what up, bitch? What's fucking next? Uh, what else, what else? 
I'm gonna save this life. So if you didn't sell the product, you will. Um, skincare routine. Can we not talk about me? I want to talk about like people that get bullied, people that feel insecure, people that you know. Because it's better than talking about me. To be honest, me, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot to talk about. And right now, at this age, I can't talk shit. <laughs> so, let's talk about something that's not me, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, hold on. Let me refresh this shit. Let's see. <sighs> My God. How do you refresh these questions? Why are people asking me if I'm a virgin? That doesn't matter. Okay, I'm answer. Are you planning to do surgery? No. Look at me, bitch. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. No! And look at my body. Shit, I'm 17 and I got a pretty little waist, pretty little shit. I still gotta grow, but no. One, because I'm scared as fuck. <laughs> it's a risk. And two, I'd rather be natural than plastic. Just in case I fight with a bitch one day, you know what I'm saying? And she wanna punch my boob, and now she goes, poof! You know what I'm saying? I've seen that shit before, and that's not good. Not good. I should wear poof! Poof! Poof, poof, poof! Hell, no. Plus, no, I love women, and I don't care if you got surgery. That's your decision, you know? But I personally like natural, you know? Because when you get your butt, let's just talk about butt. When you get your butt done and you have this weight, right? Like you're like kind of slim and you get your butt to look good with the slim. Once you lose weight or gain weight, the butt is going to stay the same. <laughs> so let's just put an example. Kim Kardashian, right? Before she had, you know, more legs, whatever, right? And she got her ass overrated. So now she has legs like this, and it looks weird. She was way prettier before all that fucking surgery, let me tell you that. But I'm just gonna leave it there. <laughs> all right. Um. I don't know. Let me fix this. Let me fix this. I don't have a big butt. Like, big butt. You know, this is my, this is me, right? My butt is like, new. Bitch's butt that men want, it's like, new. Now, this is a secret, bitches. If you have a small, normal, regular, cute butt, like this. Just know you could shake that shit better than the bitches that have the big. <laughs> I'm being fucking honest, how? I'm being fucking honest. Let me tell you, there could be like 5% of bitches that have big ass and they know how to move it. <laughs> I love Nicki Minaj. You know, I love Nicki Minaj. But when she twerks, it's just her whole body just go like this, you know? Yeah, come move a little bit when she leaning like this. But no, bitches that got natural ass or small booty, like small booty, regular booty, they be knowing how to move it. Right now I'm on jeans, so it's kind of fucking difficult. But just know that the bitches with regular booty know how to shake it. <laughs> so let's just leave it there. Because <laughs> it's not about the size. It's not about how big it is. It's how about you move it, bitch. <laughs> I could do a video today about me twerking and teaching y'all motherfuckers. Period. <laughs> oh, 
right. Next. I feel really flat. Hey, I get treated like nobody. And I can't name the people are rude to me. How old are you? Is that I can even... You know, this is what I like the question shit. Because I can't have the person chat with me here. Like, you know what I would like? Like, I click on the person's username, right? Like this. And they're asking me a question. And I don't have to look through tons of fucking shits again to search for her fucking answer. It's annoying. Like, I wish it was just a chat where I answer and she changes the quote, you know? Instagram, you gotta get some ideas. <laughs> because I got plenty. Anyway, I used to not have an ass. I do now, but it's not an ass. <laughs> It's better than before. <laughs> so, back then, what I used to wear was campana pants. Like, you know those old pants that are, like, skinny and then go like that? Like this? Yeah. I used to wear that. And I was pretty fucking skinny. This right here, that you see here, was my entire fucking leg. And my ass was nowhere to be fucking found. That shit. Y'all want me to tell y'all story? For the bitches that have no ass, which is pretty fucking cool, bitch. Because back then, motherfuckers used to like bitches with no ass. And now, you, pfft, they like bitches with ass. Wow. Next year, they're going to like bitches with no ass again. Anyways. I had friends that when I came here to Miami, todo lo que me decían era, Oh, tienes que aprender twerk. You have to learn how to twerk. Because here in Miami, you have to twerk. And I was just a bitch that came from Spain. Yo era una niña que venía de España, que ahí no se twerk. Ahí es flamenco y cinturita para arriba y para abajo, ya. Aquí era twerk. Aquí era métete para abajo, rájate y métele duro. Pero duro, duro. Entonces, I had friends that was teaching me how to twerk. You know? And they were recording. And me grababan. Intentando enseñarme a hacer twerk. So, esto es lo que me decía que hiciera. I'm gonna tell you guys what they would tell me what to do. So, I could look like shit. Actually, they were recording the videos. I didn't thought because I was a nice girl. Y'all just motherfuckers, y'all turned me into a crazy bitch. I was nice. But anyway, um, they would record me and I wouldn't thought they would post it nowhere, you know? <laughs> Stupid bitch. But they did. <laughs> and this is what happened. They would tell me, oh, to tour. This is when I was like on fucking seven, sixth grade. Seventh grade. No, six, sixth grade. So I was like this, right? And they're like, you gotta put your legs out when you do it like this. And you just gotta go more like that. So literally, I wish I could find those videos. I had pink shorts. And this was me. This was me. This was me. Like that. So they would record that shit. <laughs> Me out here looking like a fucking dumbass. Hold on. <laughs> That's just too fucking funny. Why did this shit pause? This shit paused. I'm mad. Hold on. Hold up. Did it got it or it paused? Okay. I'm gonna do it again just in case. Yeah? Okay. So this is what they would tell me to do. I was wearing some pink shorts, you know. So I was like this. They would put like, tell me to open my legs this big, like that. And so just go like this. So this was me twerking, you know. This was me twerking, and I was being recorded. And then the motherfucking next day, I walk in school with my book bag or whatever. Me looking out hot because I think or thought, bitch. Thought I learned how to work. I mean, you walk into school. I ran my breath. And you see all these motherfuckers looking at me. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Do I look pretty? No, I thought. It was that they exposed me. I'm sorry, I gotta laugh. That shit was too funny. <laughs> I bet I look like this. I'm not even like, I'm not even like, Exagerando, I look like this. That's how I look. So that video got exposed. And my ass. 
won't cry for a whole ass month. And I will have to walk inside school looking like a whole ass fucking sister looking ass bitch. Lizard looking ass bitch. <laughs> but guess what, bitch? Let me not change this pants and put some shorts on because the bitch now knows how to twerk. <laughs> Ain't good as fuck. <laughs> Ain't good as fuck. And I know how to do it with one leg, so don't fuck with me. <laughs> but anyway, just know that whoever is bullying you is a fucking asshole. And ain't gonna be nowhere in life. You're gonna be strong because they made you strong. And you're gonna be the shit because you've always been the shit. They just was trying to hide it. So I'm gonna get the fuck up because I'm running out of breath. And yeah. I love you, motherfuckers. Ha <laughs>